Now, Did you see what the NBA just released about the metaverse? What is the metaverse? By oh the my way? gosh! All right, I keep hearing about metaverse, right. and then every I'm time, so I, glad you every asked. Every time I say what's the metaverse, the only response I get is you don't know the metaverse, and I'm like, well, that does not. No, I'll break it down to you. Me. Okay. All right. All right. So Isn't you know what Spider-Man? virtual reality is, right? Isn't there a metaverse in Spider Man? Yes. Okay. Well, I think that's into the web. I don't know. Webverse or something. Maybe. I don't right, know. So okay. So you know virtual reality. Yeah. Right. Like the right. headsets. So you put on the headset, right? Yeah. And you're in a realm. You're in like a virtual realm. All right. Right. Okay, yeah. cool. So that is the simplest way of thinking about what the metaverse came from. Right. And I'll explain what the metaverse is okay. in a second. But thinking about it is you are in a portal bringing you to a new reality. Okay. Right. That's what that is. Okay. Like Matrix. Like the Matrix. Okay. Exactly. So the metaverse is basically a virtual form of everyday living. It's a secondary reality that has similarities between the day-to-day needs of reality. Okay, so if you're a cashier, you can be a cashier in the metaverse and make it? just it, as much money. Is it a money. website? What is that? I'm so confused. Is it like made up? Is this a real thing? People are like sitting down in their So it's a way? programmed reality. Think of it but like where? virtual reality and on the internet. Right, no, I get that, but like who's doing it? Whoever makes, so they're, okay. So for example. Is it like a computer game? Pretty much. Do you buy it on stream? You don't buy the metaverse because that's like saying, do you buy internet? You buy the tools that connect you to the internet, right? But who's, is anyone actually doing this? Or yes. Is no. Up? Oh my gosh. Snoop Dogg, his, his neighbor just dropped like $6 million to have a house in the metaverse next to Snoop Dogg. No, this is but this is scary. How do you get into the metaverse? You just plug in the same way you connect to a cell phone. Is it like a headset? Is it like a comp- you don't on your computer? Um, no, I think no, it's headsets. Makes sense. I think it's headsets. So that you, actually you put I don't a headset know. on and you're inside. Right. You're not and so you have an avatar, right? Oh, I hate this. So right. you're. I agree. We'll get to that in a second, right? But the metaverse is basically duplicating the real world into a virtual world. Why? And gamifying it. So this is the big question. It's like I honestly, crossing, but higher. I honestly think that this is like the end. The, <laughs> you know what I mean? I, I really do. So, but you're not actually moving your body. So it's not real. You are moving your body, but you're moving your body to move your virtual body. And the reason why they do that is because the way your brain works, your brain actually assumes what you're seeing and experiencing is the reality your body's reacting to. Here's an example. There was a quadriplegic who became paraplegic because they put on a headset on his face and walked him on a treadmill. And so his body thought his body was actually moving. So he went from quadriplegic to the tier just below it, paraplegic. So your body, your physiology is directly connected. So it can have some physiological well, no, events. If, you, yeah. if, you've, if your spinal cord has snapped and you've lost those connections, you have to have surgery to fix that. That's not a mental thing. That's a physical thing. Correct. But there's there's but a space some, in between. Yeah, yeah. Some yeah, people right. can have totally. that. Totally. Yeah. So like you're not going to be cured. <laughs> That'd be great, right? But this is true. I'll also be like, fuck it. Let's all go with the metaverse. So this people are great. being hired for jobs. There are actual trash so, people so in the metaverse let me just, who go to your property, Mariel, and take your trash out let me just and get, get paid straight. in real life. If I was in the metaverse, right? What? And I'm a trash collector. Yeah. What you would see in this real verse is me just doing this, like, like collecting trash. Like that's me collecting trash, by the way. Exactly. Like, that's what you'd see. Yes. Yes. But I'm getting paid to do that. Yes. In real life by Bitcoin. True story. This is real. People are spending millions of dollars on virtual real estate in the metaverse. Millions of dollars. It doesn't make sense to me. Look, I'm with you. I understand. That's why I honestly it's think so squeaky, it's so right? bad. Let's try not to <laughs> squeak it, um, but we'll, we'll have the WD-40 it. But everyone's moving to the metaverse, so they're going to be- But you still have to have a life here. You can't No. Just, you do. You no, you don't. You can't eat and drink in the metaverse and be full. You'll, you'll waste away. Okay. So they have a tube connected to your headset. Uh, no, but that's I'm not right. I'm not even exaggerating. We are going from real world to metaverse primary. It's like what primary. happened to Wally, right? Didn't that happen to Wally? It's literally the Matrix. It's literally my the matrix. Blow my nose. This is stressing me out. Okay, the way you said that while reaching back, I thought you were just about to let one rip. <laughs> I was like, so I was like, this would be so great if it was in the metaverse. You're right. But isn't that the strangest thing? So real life jobs are transferring. Okay, but that no one fucking squeak me, is gonna kill let me. Let me just say this right now. <laughs> it's gonna kill me. You have to have a lot of money to live in the metaverse. No. Right? 
Well, to get it connected to it. Not right now because it's early and you could be an early adopter. And so, get okay, it the ground okay, but if you move to the metaverse, would you collect trash? No. Like. Well, how much are you paying me? Would you would you, know you want to collect trash you know in what? real life? I really believe, trash collection is a great gig to have. Yeah, it's like where the mob. It pay, no, not even thing. that. Just it pays super super well. It's stable. It's unionized. I'm like I would if you need to have a good high pay. Like I respect people who. Like, yeah, me too. People Seriously. shit on like garbage men. I'm like they are doing it right. No, they're, they're in a they're, union. They're yeah. making a lot of money. They've got good benefits. They make like one fifteen, don't they, they? They work hard. It's an yeah. honest job. I'm like hats off to you, man. Like and they deal with all of our garbage. I'm like that is a solid job, and I, I agree. respect anyone who does that. People kind of like I think we're leaving the era of shitting on white on uh, blue collar jobs. As you yes right? we should as we should like honestly like any job that's like an honest job. Yeah, I'm like. I think that's great. 